Hey, Dave. Hey, it's day 30 of March. Still no sign of you across that condo, across Lindsay's condo in the rented home that you said you were going to rent and harass her from. Where are you, Dave? It's day 30 and no epic footage. No epic footage whatsoever. You brag for a week that you had this house rented across from Lindy's condo. And still no sign of you. So that means all you did to the people was lie. Yes, you lied to the people. Made up some fantasy story in your head like you normally do. Yes, like the story that a man with a tumor is going after elbow and birds with a shotgun. Yeah, how cute. And you think it's funny. You make up these fantasy stories and you find your fantasy stories funny. How a man's gonna walk up to Burks' house and act like he has something he needs to sign. And then when Burks opens the door, He's going to get shot in the face with a shotgun. <laughs> Man, you're so retarded. But you got fantasy stories like most of your life is just nothing but lies and fantasies. Just like getting the rental home across from Lindy. It's much like your lie about your thousand acre farm, your new truck. Yes, and all the trucks on the farm by you. Yeah, like all those lies. Oh man, like the baby. The baby, remember that? You all were going to have a baby and a new house. Those type of lies, huh, Dave? That's what you only good at is lying. And you're talking about Elbow's tax returns. You have no clue what Elbow has or hasn't done. But you yourself owe $100,000 in credit card debt. <laughs> you can't make this stuff up because you're so dumb. But you can make it up because you're dumb. Are you paying taxes on your disability insurance, huh? Your little government check you get every month while you sit in your trailer all alone. There's no rich girl for me. You sit there all alone and live in your little fantasy world. Yes, your little disability check. We all know about it, Dave. We know your mom is paying your internet bill and some of the expenses for the dump of the trailer you're living in and hiding out from the trolls. Uh, like all your lies about having lung cancer and a new class A RV that you got busted out on. You always getting busted out. Why are you so worried about Elbow and his taxes and his money? He seems to be doing a lot better than you. Elbow has a paid for home on wheels. You're in a dumpy trailer that mama has to help pay for. <laughs> what cancer do you have this month? What cancer do you have for April? You already had lung cancer, mouth cancer, liver cancer. What new cancers are that you can come up with to make the people feel sorry for you? I love it when you told everybody you had $40,000 sitting in the bank. <laughs> you don't even have a checking account, I bet. <laughs> You're so dumb. But that's what we like about you is the lies make you a lost player. And adding dumb on top of it makes you even a better lost clown. But get up a new lie like the streaming house that you were going to bring people to. And you told them a couple of weeks ago you had to cancel because of the virus. <laughs> you don't have money for jack shit. Yes, your wife ran off with the money. She earned all the income, not you. How can you earn any income when you sit at home for 20 years and lied about getting disability so that you could get on it? So that you could get on it and get your little government check. Oh, you're so funny, but so pathetic. I'm going to let you go, Dave. 
but come up with a new one for April. You've already gone through two streaming houses you never showed up at. <laughs> All this expensive camera equipment. What woman are you going to harass in the month of April, Dave? Because that's the only thing you do, is harass women. Make up fantasy stories about your life and talk about a man with a brain tumor is going to kill Elbow and Bergs. Do you think Bergs is that dumb? Do you realize Bergs has a college degree and you didn't even get out of high school? <laughs> That's because you're dumb. You're dumb. But I'm going to let you go, Dave. I know you love harassing women, but uh, you need a new uh, storyline, Dave. It's getting boring out here, Dave. Bye-bye, Dave. Until next time, bye-bye.